What is up everybody? This is the Wardface and today I am back and I don't know if I'm happy or sad to say that we are starting episode 5 of The Wolf Among Us today. Um, I say that because I'm of course happy and excited to start this up. We left on a big cliffhanger, we are in a pretty tense situation, and uh, this game has just been so incredibly insane and awesome. Uh, up to this point. So I am extremely happy to finally be at the last part and see where this all wraps up. But at the same time, I'm sad because that means it's over soon. That means in all actuality, in all like uh, just kind of looking at how this has gone so far, it's probably four episodes left, including this one. So uh, unfortunately, I'm, I'm kind of sad to see that this is coming to an end. But also very, very excited, of course, to uh, see where this goes. Um, as always, just a big, again, I, I, I know I say this a lot, but a huge thank you to you guys for just suggesting this game, because it's a game that I missed when it first came out, and, um, I'm just really happy that you guys suggested this, uh, because I, I kind of would have been upset if I uh, had never played this game, uh, just because it's so amazing, and I have such, like, I guess a history with Telltale games, so if somehow I hadn't played this game, I, I don't know what I would have done. Uh, but that's enough of my talking. Let's start this up. Episode 5. five. Uh, sorry, I'm just I'm tripping over my words in an excitement. Episode 5. Cry Wolf. Um, <laughs> it looks like Bigby is entering his uh, super crazy wolf form again. And uh, he may have ripped some people apart because his hands are bloody as hell. Uh, enough talking. We're going to start this up and see where this goes. If you guys remember, we left off in a very I mean, intense situation. Your eyes and the teeth? You're not really supposed to do that, are you? Uh, it's out of sync. <laughs> oh, you are lucky I spared your life. Not if I can avoid it. No. Holly's sister, Lily. I just don't know what Bigby's doing. If he, if he cares about it, if he even gives a shit. That's why you can't tell me anything. It's the ribbon, isn't it? We're destroying the tree. No! I offered her a We're job. We're burning the tree, Snow. Hey, you're not really gonna send me to the farm, are you? I don't know. Snow will come around. She's just... You know, the crane thing hit her hard, and she doesn't really know who her friends are right now. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I hate you, Bloody Mary. I really hope we get to give her what's oh, God, good Bigby. in this one. This time was no joke. Eat as many metal shellings as you see fit, but take just one more silver round near your heart, and the only place I'll be visiting you is the morgue. I really hope that's not foreshadowing. When you get the crooked man, make sure you bring him back alive. He has to stand trial. Why don't you have a seat, Sheriff? We have a great deal to discuss. And I totally ended that one in, like, the most badass way I could. I flipped open my lighter, lit a cigarette, and prepared for our big battle with, uh, with <laughs> the Crooked Man. Uh, I hope we don't get into, like, a super fight right now, because I don't know if I'm prepared for that. And if, uh, you guys remember, we are literally in that room with the Crooked Man, with, like, both Tweedles, uh, the Pimp Guy, like, every single enemy we've ever made in this game is in this room with us, so we have to kind of talk our way out of this. Uh, in a way where we don't get instantly murdered. Um, just so intense. I like how this is just going straight from the previously on the Wolf Among Us straight into the game. It's not doing like a little uh, intro scene, like a nice 15 minute intro. No. Come a long way. Going right in. You must be tired. Yes, this is how we ended it. And if my envoys are correct, you haven't had a lot of rest recently. 
What's up, Jersey Devil? Please, Sheriff. Relax for a moment, will Tell you? Tell your guys to stop pulling guns on me, maybe. Do you want a drink? Something to eat? Vivian makes a very nice, very... It's elegant. Really, her carpaccio. Tear him out. It's lobster. Sirloin. What's with your eyes, sir? Well, gramercy me. Take a seat at the very least. No? Your eye is disgusting. What do you think you're doing? He's gonna. Mr. Wolf is our guest, and I have every intention of cooperating. So don't waste the silver. Sit down, Jersey. That's right. We don't want to have well, to kick Sheriff, your ass again. For the sake of transparency, why don't you tell us why you're here? It would help settle everyone's nerves, I think. You tried to you kill forget me. forget what happened at the Pudding and Pie? You and your goons tried to kill me. I'm truly sorry for that whole debacle. It was not my intention to put you or Miss White in any sort of danger. My wish was merely to take Crane, Sheriff. And as soon as the assignment grew out of control, I put a stop to it. I know that that doesn't change what happened to you. Uh, and I can only offer my sincere apologies. Snow stopped it, not you. You didn't stop it out of the kindness of your heart. You stopped it because Snow White offered up Crane. That may have appeared to you to be the case, but I assure you, it wasn't. And I hope you believe me when I say, Sheriff, that I sincerely mean to make it up to you. And how do you plan on doing that? The recent murders that have gotten such attention as of late. I don't relish telling you that they were perpetrated by an employee of mine. It's a very unfortunate bit of business, but I promise you that the matter will be dealt with internally. I just want to settle the issue for you. And to assure you that it's over with. Then who you did really it? You really don't need to worry yourself further. An unfortunate bit of business. You're gonna tell me right now who killed him. Sheriff, I have complete respect for you and your job. I hope you know that. But I simply can't divulge that information. Damn, we should have said we know who it was. You really shouldn't worry yourself. As I said, I've got this under control. You let no, two people get I'm murdered. I'm deal with it right now. Yeah, right. What do you think this is? Some kind of negotiation? The man said he'd take care of it. So why don't you take the hint I'm the law and here. get out? I'm the law here, not you. Now tell me who did it. You think I'm scared of you? <laughs> You're nothing more That's than a- That's enough. I was hoping it wouldn't come to this. But, in the interest of preserving our alliance, if you have to know, it was Georgie. Seriously? However, like I said, I'll be handling the matter if you don't mind. Georgie, you got what you wanted, so just sit down now. Oh, stupid Georgie. Yeah. I killed him, so what? What do you mean, so what? I can't punch him. You should have just kept your nose where it fucking belonged. Georgie. Can we just, let's stare him down. Look, the fact is, George here misinterpreted one of my instructions. Misinterpreted? And I want to make things right. So, let's work something out. What's there to work out? I'm protected, aren't I? Your protection has limits. And I think you've far exceeded yours. But you could murder someone in cold blood like that. You fucking asked me to do this. And then you attempt to, to blame him. me for it. You will be silent while we discuss what to do with you. This is right, bollocks, sis. You're just gonna let him do this? So what do you say, Sheriff? Can we discuss terms? Yeah, he comes with me. Oh, wow. Consider it a gift. Ensuring our continued cooperation. Okay, yeah, let's right. talk. Let's talk. <laughs> you can't just hand me over. That's actually, that's not that bad. Shit? You said you'd cover for us. For minor infractions, not murder. Just go with him, Georgie. You're gonna sink us all. What's wrong with you people? You're really gonna sell him out just like you that? You think I'd give a fuck if I'm the one Who the shit do you think you fuckers are out the fuck out of I here. I do apologize, Sheriff, but I think it's best if you leave now. There's no way I'm going with him. Are you kidding me? Things are about to get unpleasant, and I would rather you weren't here to watch. You can go join that whore at the bottom of the lake for all I give a shit, but he's not taking me anywhere. 
Is that so? I'll roll over on the lot of you before I let that shit happen. What are you saying? Yeah, what the fuck? You're gonna make sure we all go down this shitter with you? I told you! I guess grab Georgie? Get the fuck away from me! He's the one you fucking want! This could have gone so well. But you just had to complicate things. Me? To I... speak the truth, I've never been a very good mediator. Why negotiate when you can just decide? Uh-oh. Oh, wonderful. <laughs> Our friend is here. Did I miss anything good? Well, look at you all fixed up. <clears throat> what? They're all attacking me? <clears throat> oh, crap. Seriously? I thought they were handing Georgie over. Take this. Oh crap. You don't How is that like a portal? Come on. We're pretty much done here. Oh, he's the most dangerous. Oh crap. I'd like to say it was nice knowing you, but I'll be glad to see your insides turned out. You understand that the Oh my. Oh my god, what is going on? Oh, what? Oh, oh God. Oh. We're just murdering like all of his goons. This way. Stupid Jersey Devil. Do you never learn? He just like never learns. This is like injured wolf. What in the hell? That just went to complete crap. Come on, Georgie. Ooh, that all went to hell. Shit. I know. I know. Oh, you guys better watch out. She's, she's like covering for him now? Oh my lord, wolf. Bigby, you are absolutely insane. <laughs> Bigby, you can't just run down the street like this. <laughs> what the hell is going on? Bigby, you can't do this! Oh my god, oh my god. Where'd they go? Snow is not gonna be happy with us. We are literally breaking every rule that she laid out for us. Not intentionally, may I add, but... She told us to do this by the rules. She told us to grab the crooked man. And she told us not to turn into our final form. I've literally done the opposite of all of those things. What are like the humans seeing in this? Shit. Oh god. Fuck. What was that? We got the right ones, right? <laughs> oh, the other one had the crooked man in it? Let's see if we can rip him out at the top. Take him off! I can't! Come on. Come on, we've got it! Are you serious? We had that. I had that perfectly. Gun it! Are you sure? Do it! What's that bar down the bottom mean? He's not moving. Keep going! Oh, fuck. Oh, 
Come You're on. Going crack. back into the pudding and pie. How dumb could you get? <laughs> We're just gonna waltz back in like nothing happened. Anything good in his car? No, nothing good, just a lot of blood. A whole lot of blood. Let's go straight in. Georgie! Oh, Georgie Porgie! And unfortunately, holy crap, I'm gonna have to end that as the intro to the episode 5. Holy crap, that went absolutely insane. That entire thing. I, I th is it Was there a way to get out of that intro without killing and murdering everything that just happened? Like, what What the hell just went wrong? All Like, everybody was going against Georgie, and everybody was standing by the Crooked Man, so I thought it gave me the option to grab the Crooked Man or Georgie. So I grabbed Georgie because it just seemed like they were ready to give him up. He didn't like the way the things were going. He obviously had already admitted to the crime. I felt like, obviously, if we grabbed the Crooked Man, everybody would have turned on us, and that same thing probably would have happened. So I figured we at least get the murderer, and then we go the, after the Crooked Man after. That way, I could at least explain it to Snow. We had the murderer, and we could still tie it into the Crooked Man somehow. But for whatever reason, when I went to grab Georgie, he got away, and everybody just turned on me. One of the Tweedles got stabbed, or shot, or whatever happened. Uh, Everything just went to hell. Like, everything just went absolutely insane. And, uh, that's where I'm gonna leave it off. Holy crap, this game is... I, I can already tell Episode 5 is gonna be absolutely insane. Uh, so we're gonna continue this next time. I really hope you guys are enjoying this. And I really hope you guys are ready to see whatever happens in these last few episodes. So, uh, that's gonna end this one for me. I hope you guys enjoyed, and I will see you next time. Have a nice day. Goodbye.